Guy Fieri's uh, Tournament of Champions is back on the Food Network, and there's uh, 32 comp competitors from around the country. These are some of the best chefs in the world, right? So what are the chances that we might have a local chef? That's on this incredible competition. Well, we do. We have Chef Carlos Anthony with Herb and Wood joining us. How awesome is this? Well, thank you so much Boy, for you're having me. You're big time, man. Uh, this is great. So um, the it is, this season has been shot. It airs this weekend. This is on Sunday on, on the Sunday. Food Network at 7, 8 Central. Okay, and you're in this. And yes. um, you know how it all ends right now, but can't tell us. I cannot uh, we're, say We're going to have to tune in to find out uh, how this all goes. So thanks for joining us on the back lot. Well, um, thanks for having we're me. We're going to be cooking up some stuff while we talk about this exciting uh, um, endeavor that you're on here. First of all, what is this? This smells delicious. So I got a real special treat for you. Okay. I couldn't just bring anything. No, you know, well, if you have a chef from the Tournament of Champions, right. I want to bring you some some real wow food. Good, good. Uh, so what I have today is a barbecue quail. Okay. What we did in the restaurant is made a really awesome pomegranate barbecue mm. sauce with pomegranate molasses and Worcestershire and brown mm. sugar. We cooked it down, we grilled it, and then we finished it with a little bit more of that barbecue sauce. You are selling it. It's like it's like you've done this before. <laughs> like you've done this for the show. Once or twice. It's like you've had to impress Guy Fieri himself. <laughs> uh, okay, so this looks good. We're going to bring this over to this other table, right? Awesome. Yeah, I'd love for you to help me out. You yeah, know, this is part it. of the action. Okay. You know, I feel like Guy's here right now uh -huh. yelling at me, telling me to hurry up. Come on, hurry Timer's up. on. The I'm timer's hurt. on. Yeah, exactly. Awesome. I mean, I, speaking of that, it, it, does he yell a lot? I mean, I, I feel like his blood pressure's got to be pretty high. <laughs> you know, he is, he's one of the most passionate guys. And he cares about the industry. Mm -hmm. It's what Tournament of Champions really is about, is, is bringing all of these amazing chefs and showcasing our industry, our talent, yeah. our skill, and our love for food. Absolutely. You know, and it's really, really amazing. You but gotta have that passion. We can sense that passion in you, oh, Chef. I love it. And Thank so you. um the other part of the passion is having good stuff and knowing yes. how to play it and how to make it, how to sell it, right? So uh, you're gonna put me to work. Absolutely. Okay? I'd right. love for you to help me out. I want to give you a little tips and tricks how to make it up. Think yeah. about this as like your your typical chicken wing, right? Sure. We've okay. elevated it, we've made it a really All nice right. quail, a little bit more delicate. Right. But we're gonna make a nice pistachio gremolata with some pomegranate. Okay. And one of the hardest things with pomegranates is how do I get those oh, kernels tell me out? About it. I tried to make a cocktail with pomegranate. And it was a nightmare. It was a nightmare. <laughs> so, so, so many so people, bad. they want to do different things. They want to rip it. So I'm going to pull this out here and I'm okay. going to teach you a little chef's trick. Yes, please do. We what like we hats. do is we put it right into the bowl, just cut it in half. Okay. And you're just going to give it a couple oh, little hits. It ain't me. And it pops right out. You easy, be breezy, me, chef. I was like picking each one out with a tweezers. <laughs> you know, they say <laughs> chefs don't have to be very good at uh, anything too difficult, but they just have to know many little things. There's so, little tricks you got to learn tricks. along the way. So if you could just help me pop okay, out a couple oh, now of those. I can, sure. Just, you know, it's all in the wrist. Yep, boom, Just a boom, little boom, boom. boom. Okay. You're a pro. Boom, 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 boom. All right. right. Okay, good. Yeah, keep on tapping simple, this thing. Simple, simple, simple. I love the taste that these give and then the uh, the color it brings to Absolutely. the Absolutely. Uh, very underused product. So what we did here is we used uh, some of the reduce inside of the barbecue sauce. Here okay. we go. Now yeah, we're getting yeah. everywhere. You said now we're wrist. getting everywhere. Man, I got hockey wrist. Man. I'll bang this <laughs> thing. I'll tell you what. Yeah. I love it. Uh, like a wrist shot here. Yeah. You know, beautiful. So that looks fantastic. Okay, so, good. So this looks like a wonderful topping. Wonderful. Nice little yeah, relish I love that the we'll red. do. Okay. Um, so what we can do is pull out a little bit of these white pips that might have popped out okay, of here. Well, that was the over wristing of oh, the yeah, pomegranate. You didn't yeah. know how strong okay. your wrists were today. Um, so what we'll do then is we'll add a little bit of pistachio. Okay. These are roasted, salted. Okay, so you throw those into there. Okay. Throw those right into there. And then we're gonna just cut up a little bit of herb, right? Okay. So we wanna take some parsley here. Uh, some chervil. This is kind of like a French parsley. Okay. Uh, this is a fancy way, a uh, fancy chef term there, but it, it's just parsley. The producer, who's my guy Fieri, is saying we've got like two minutes. So two now, minutes. We're, now we're under we're, the gun. We're so under the gun. Also in it's your just here. like uh, Tournament of Champions. I'm telling you, yeah. I'm keeping us on it. time. They're telling me boom, you got a boom. plate. You wow, have four plates to go. You have four <laughs> plates awesome. to go. What we'll do is we'll finish it with our chef's life, extra virgin olive chef's oil. Chef's life. Okay. Beautiful oh right yeah. Here. Olive oil makes everything so. Everything so much. It brings it all together. Part of it too. Flavor. We have it's, it's California citrus season. This is a car. Let's yep. give it a little bit Throw in there. That in there. Beautiful. Mm -hmm. And then there you hear you have it. You have your your beautiful barbecue quail, that pistachio gremolata that you've helped me create. I'm still trying to envision what are, what are we putting this on? We're so putting this on the actual. We're gonna throw it right onto the quail. quail. Okay. You know it's gonna give you a nice delicious bite. So that way while you're chewing through those wings, yeah, eating it right it's off the so bone. It's not so gamey. You have a beautiful bite and pop of that pomegranate. Uh, okay, so you're gonna throw it right on there. Oh, why not? Oh, Look okay. At Look at that. This is an award-winning dish right here. I was gonna say. Yeah, you know, I might even say you're that. Maybe he did say it to you on the show. You're gonna have to watch tune that. in on Sunday to find out how I did. But okay. with food like this, I could be going home a champion. That's right. And <laughs> we will find. And by the way, um, the champion, because I'm gonna sample this here at the end of the segment. Please. Um, so how do you cut this thing up? 
So just, what we'll do is, what's fantastic about this, and I absolutely yep, adore, nice plate here. adore how um, we have some beautiful winter uh, winter greens oh, here. Look at that, yeah. And then we'll go ahead and take our tongs. By the way, feeling like winter out here, and you're doing the t-shirt. <laughs> you, you've been running around, so you've been staying warm. Well, you know, right? the grill yeah. will heat you up. That's true. <laughs> right, right. Okay. You know, so we have these absolutely beautiful Looks wings nice. here. Okay, yeah. Look at that. I'll try not to get you tur too dirty. Is bone in then still yes, on this? Yes, I still oh, have okay. a cute little awesome. bone. And the reason you do that delicate. is just to You want to keep the juices in there. And you know what? I think with food like this, you want it to be fun and Absolutely. interactive. Yeah. And so you can just grab it by the bone and, and gnaw away. Man, but this oh is, man. I'm telling you, these aren't the Super Bowl wings the most <laughs> guys had at home. These are fancy, fancy wings here. Um, championship a, wings. Uh, championship wings. Speaking of championship, there's a... Uh, there's a purse this year. Yes. And that, does that give a little extra flair to the well, contestants? Or so what? this is the first year where, you know, it's not a small purse. This is a hundred thousand dollars that we are bucks. talking about. So wow. um, all these chefs who I promise you will do it for their pride. Absolutely. Uh, just suddenly get a little bit more fire. Awesome. In okay. I'm going to give it a little bite. I'm going to give it a little oh, bite. I love it. Before we send it back into Netta here, I'm going to give this a little bite here and remind everyone real quick where they can watch the big show here. So on Food Network on Sunday, 7, 8 Central. You can also stream it on Discovery Plus. Oh, wow. Oh yeah. wow! That that Inf um, I'm embarrassed to say that I served any sort of wings at my Super Bowl <laughs> together after trying these. <laughs> chef, really good stuff. Thank Where you. can people check you out here locally? So I'm the chef at Herbin Wood in Little Italy. Mm. So, good. so good. come check us out. I'm telling you, I'm gonna save you one of these, Netta. This is okay. just so good. The flavors, everything you put into this, you can taste. It just pops. Uh, yeah, and you did so <clears> good <throat> with the pomegranate. I'm impressed. I'm telling you, it's Thank all in the wrist. <laughs> it's all in the wrist. I, I had a little something to do with this, but it's all this guy. He's, he's a true champ. We'll find out if he's a champ here coming up. Well, thanks for having me. Thanks again, Thank Chef.